Will disenchanted charm young fans of the original film? Most definitely. I know that change can be scary, but it can also be exciting. Amy Adams returns in this fairy tale musical sequel, and this time around, the princess runs into problems after moving her family to the suburbs. That's not an adventure, that's a landfill. While part two is still very much kid friendly, be ready for some potentially upsetting scenes. Characters turn evil and treat one another cruelly. Lives are threatened by dragons, giants, fires, and magic spells. Plus, references are made to the destruction of the world. Nothing will be as it was before. As for other iffy stuff, there's really not much. Just some mild language, teen flirting, and kisses between a married couple. Common Sense says Disenchanted is okay for kids six and up. For top picks and advice to fit your family, visit us at commonsensemedia.org.